New to calligraphy? In this video, I will show you everything you need to start your calligraphy journey. I'm Kirsten Burke. I've been a calligrapher for over 20 years, so welcome to my channel. By the end of this video, you will know which nibs to buy, which pen holders to buy, which ink and which paper to use. So your calligraphy journey starts right here. So let's begin. So one, nibs. All sorts of pointed nibs out there, so it can be a bit daunting as to which to choose. The most common mistake is to go buy a traditional calligraphy kit and you'll end up with a broad edge nib, which is no good for modern calligraphy. I've selected the ones I like and they are the Lennart 30, it's a great all-rounder, Lennart 256, a great robust nib for when you're beginning, Principle, which gives you a finer, more delicate line. And I've put them together in a kit, so you can buy them all in one go. Two, pen holders. There are straight pen holders and oblique pen holders. I recommend starting with a straight one. Key thing to look for is a universal pen holder. That just means it will hold any nib. Number three, ink. Where do you buy it? Which one's the best for calligraphy? Here's a few that I recommend. De La Rowney do a great acrylic ink. Manuscript Chinese ink. Sumi ink. Go to my Amazon Influencer page and I put everything there in one place. And number four, paper. You've probably already got it at home in your printer. Printer paper is great for practicing on. And then when you're ready to do a finished piece, try Bristol board or a smooth watercolor paper. And that's it. So now you know exactly what you need. Watch out for my next tutorial on how to use it all. I'll see you then.